This is the new 2020 230 walk around by Striper Boats. This one is powered with a 300 horsepower Suzuki electronic control and throttle. Give you a little walk around here. This is displayed in the light blue color option. Do a little walk around here to the stern. This is the standard hardtop shown with the optional full enclosure. Keep you weather tight, waterproof in most conditions. It is on the optional tandem axle galvanized trailer that is packaged there at the factory with Striper. It's a Shorelander trailer. It's a galvanized steel. It has disc brakes on both axles. Back here at the business end of the boat. That is a 300 horsepower Suzuki four stroke. This is maximum power on this boat. Does an incredible job. You can see the built in swim steps. This has a deep boarding ladder to get back into the boat if you accidentally fell out or if you're a diver, snorkeler, or swimming. Has the Lenco trim tabs. This is the stern of the 230 walk around striper. As you can see, it has a very deep water ladder making it easy for anyone to get back into the boat. Strapped on the back is this big 300 horsepower Suzuki. Incredible performance. The boat is up on plane, less than half throttle. Very economical and very powerful. Lenco trim tabs are standard. They also come with a light up display to let you know how far in or out the trim tabs are. Full enclosure for the hardtop. waste pump out for the pump porta potty so when you're at the dock you can clean your head before you go home all of the through holes are all stainless steel this model shows your pop-up cleats midship and then at the bow port and starboard you can see the deep V on this hull very aggressive chines reverse angle to them and reverse angle to the lifting strakes 
This offers the boat an incredible dry ride, even in head seas with some crosswind. Incredibly dry running boat. This is all hand laminated. Spare tire is also an option that is ordered with this boat. So let's go up inside and take a look at the interior cockpit. The cockpit interior of the 230, big, deep, roomy, shows the canvas all zipped up. We have two fish boxes in the floor, port starboard side also have their own macerated pump out. Big splash well, never have to worry about getting water back in the deck from the engine. As you can see, we have a fresh water handheld shower. And then we have our live bait tank in the port corner. Has a pump, you just flip the switch automatically circulates keep your bait fresh all day long this is the outlet for the plug for the onboard battery charger plug your extension cord keep your battery topped up 24 7. these are some inserts for storing deck brushes small gaffs notice the tow rail at the bottom so you can keep your balance while fighting that big fish. Here's some hose receptacles here. One's for raw water, one's for fresh water. Come back here to the bait tank. It's our bait tank. It's nice and deep, rounded edges. More cup holders, rod holders. Over here we have the location for your battery switch. Easy access in and out of your boat. Put the helm. Nine inch color Garmin. GPS, maps, all the color Suzuki instrumentation, the Kicker Media Center, all the switch panel, Seats. In the radio box, VHF radio, a cabin door, looking through the eyes and glass up on the front. Pop this open. Here we go down in the cabin. It's our galley. It's our table. Picture of the galley. Butane stove. Folds out of the cabinet. And on top, you have a pressurized fresh water system. Little portal opens for venting. 
has a built-in screen. Some reading lights, all LED. Two speakers to the sound system. These cushions remove and fill in the gap when the table is not erected. Storage underneath the compartments. The cabin of the 230. This is the table in the up position. Notice it has the real nice snap out cabin mats. That is an option. This is the pump out porta potty. Storage underneath all the compartments. Both of the backrests come out. They're Velcroed in and they fill in this gap. When the table drops down, they fit on top of the table and it forms a cushion area all the way to the walk, it, walk through the cabin. Those are the two rear jump seats that go in the port and corner stern area. And back out to the helm area. Back out a little bit here. And we'll open up the floor. This is the location for the batteries and the battery charger as you can see.